fear, and all the same things can go on. You know, spiritual personality types. But more importantly, what I found was a tool to allow me to be receptive. I trust science with the experience that I'm calling body-mind, but I don't think science can tell me what reality is. Galileo, back in 1633 or so, said, I think that tastes, odors, colors, and so on reside in consciousness. You know, it's love. It is love library. And I, was really I, th I think that fear, when a fear comes up as, in our experience, as limiting, it points us toward a sacrifice that we're ready to make. What is the essence? The essence of something is that part of a thing that cannot be removed. We are li our, our life becomes a constant experimenting, meaning a constant living in accordance with the non-dual hypothesis. At that point, nothing matters. basically not thinking about yourself. Uh, it's not about you. <laughs> this day, <laughs> where non-dualism is the reality and not the theory. Cool. Let's repeat the mantra together. By right? together, I mean after me. Unless you're good at like telepathic thought, then you can do it simultaneously. The little ridges on it. And those are ridges made by our deepest ancestor. There are vast realms of consciousness, still undreamed.